Damn. Oh, y'all. Those of us ooh, who have waited all this time for a verdict ooh, for Lorenzen Wright and some kind of justice for his death, I guess we all can be a little happy right now that Billy Ray Turner was found guilty. And I'm happy that he was found guilty. Um, what they did to that man was just insane. And that's like that song. What you won't do, do for love. You tried everything, but you don't give up. See, love is a spell. And if you can't control yourself and it, it will control you. It will make you kill. It will make you steal. It will make you like you under a spell. And if you can't control the spell that you under, God, 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 help you. Because what it seems like has happened to uh, Billy Turner was that woman manipulated him, gave him sex, and like all the other men that she used her feminine wiles against, including Lorenzen when he was a little boy, a young teenager. Shara knew how to get the money. Shara was crazy about money. And everything she did, wow, was just so she could get some money. Just think, you had six kids by somebody. <clears throat> How can you hate somebody that bad? You done had six kids. Your death travel around your bed a thousand times when you give birth. So six thousand times, seven thousand times, death done went around your door to pump out babies for Lorenz and Wright. And then you didn't have no kind of feeling for that than to kill him. I'm so happy for Deborah. I'm so happy for her. This is his mother, Deborah and Marion, is speaking right now. Here she is. Deborah Marion. It just didn't make sense. I'm glad it's gone, no, but I wish he'd leave today. I saw him the battle for me, but I'm just glad we got you know, it took 12 years. I would, if it took 24 years to get that at the end, I wouldn't have <laughs> But we got it now. We got to worry no more. Maybe I can say all night now. We did it. Thanks to the deal. Yeah. It'll never be closed because I never see my son again. You know, until I go meet him. Uh, this is just some satisfaction for me yeah. and my family. You know, yes. he did out my son, so now he's going to do his time. He did a crime, now he got to go do the time. That's what I'm glad about because he's not walking around. Free no more. That's what I didn't want him free because he could do it to somebody else. If he can get somebody to manipulate him to kill somebody else, <laughs> imagine what he could do on his own. This woman manipulated him. Got his head crazy. Miss Mary, at the beginning of the proceedings, uh, a couple of years <coughs> back, you told Sarah in court, Why did you kill my son? Right. If you were able to speak with her today after this verdict, what would you tell her? You don't want to know. It's not, uh, it's not recorded. Okay. But, Can you sanitize it? Part? Okay, you no know, good, good for nothing. Killing my child for money, and it couldn't even keep no longer than ten months. What did what did you do that? A million dollars? That's what it was about, money. As I told him when he first came, a million he dollars. I talked to his wife. She's the only one gonna benefit. What's for that million dollars that she spent in ten months for the life insurance? Yes, yeah, for the money. I kept telling him, follow the money, follow the money. You will find out. And y'all see where it went. Did you have any doubt Billy Turner was involved? Did they, was there nope. any doubt in you? No, no. How are you going to call me this time? It's six times a day. Uh uh. No, he guilty. Guilty, guilty. Jim, her cousin, but that was her lover. That's how he got manipulated. You know, he was between rock and a hard place. Do I do what my woman want me to do or do I do the right thing? Do the right thing and get paying off over now. I better call him over there with her. That's what he did. Well, you, heard, you heard how they describe your son running through that rural area. 
uh, like mm. a deer. But they weren't lying. They weren't like that. That's why I know he saw him. Because he wasn't lying. My son actually run like a deer. He was there. He saw him run. You can't just say, hey, somebody told me. You don't tell nobody he run like a deer. He was running fast. Not like no deer. You saw him running and jumping fences. Miss Mary, were you surprised to know the sheriff shot him? I, what, what my police said? I told them. They told me no. I said, I don't care what y'all say. They have shot my son in the face. Yeah. I knew that from day one. When they, when they get there, so I looked at my, uh, at, on top of the papers. I know, but I know he got a face shot. I know that. You know, I hadn't even looked at my paper. I still haven't looked at me. But I knew if he had a face shot, she did. She did. Ms. Mary, you heard of these meetings that took place. Right. The plot. To kill your son. Right. And then you hear Ooh. that uh Cheryl, Miss Wright, right. thought your son had a had a hit out on her. For what reason? Right. What you gonna have a hit out of your broke ex-wife for? You gotta take care of the kid by yourself, then why you gonna give me like I said, don't make sense. Give me a reason. Why would he have a hit out on her? You know why she have a hit out on him? Million dollars. That's why. Nope, he had a hit out on her. Or what? Is there anything in this trial that you didn't know that you learned at that point? <coughs> or was everything kind of sort of? <coughs> well, a lot of stuff I already knew, and I told the police, like, you know, shooting him in the face. I knew this. A lot of stuff I, you have to know, sir. She's one of me. You will really have to know her. She'll tell you your shirt is on once, and you know it's fine. And that's why you start thinking, is it on? Or is it fine? Because she'd be a convention. What do you think more that James be in prison? Uh, do you think more people need to be in prison for this crime besides Shara and Billy? Jim, that's it. Do you think he should have faced charges? Yes, he saw him jumping like a deer. Did nobody tell him nobody jumping like no deer? He saw it with his own eyes. You think Jimmy was there? Yes, three people, three guns. I don't get it. They said they couldn't find the gun Shara lost. Well, they found it, but they don't know where it is. Yeah, well, right. Okay. Who don't know where it is? Be Jim and him. Jim ain't gonna implicate his. You see how he skated around his cuz. First he told us she was in the street. Then he told now he told me she wouldn't make up your mind. You know, it, like doing the stuff of who he said and she said, I remember. And he said Cheryl was running in the street. When Jimmy described going to Atlanta twice to kill your son, how did that make you feel? Cheryl, no good, good for nothing. He didn't do it for himself. He wasn't gonna get nothing from no reason being dead. But what Cheryl might have gave him, niggas and penny. That's it. Right to mind. And, and he just, and he's not a good person anyway, because that black lawyer that Cheryl had when she first got arrested here in Memphis, that's the lawyer that Lorenzen hired when he, for Jimmy when he killed his girlfriend. Lorenzen hired a lawyer for him. But then he killed him a few years later. Mm. Oh, wow, yeah. really? How does that make you feel that anyone would want to even have the thought? Oh, I didn't know that. Sickening. It make, it, I, can't, uh, I can't think of nothing why I want to kill anybody, just long a person of my son's stature. Anybody. Murder, you know, accident. You hear accident. There were no accidents. There was intent. Damn. And I remember going to those celebrations every year that you had. Ah. So oh, we right. never gave up. Mm -mm. I could, if I gave up, who was going to stand in my place? Uh, I'm his mom and his daddy right now. I don't see that either. You gonna go visit him tomorrow? Yes. No, today. What's in the cemetery park? See, all the cemeteries don't close in this city. They stay open all night. But this cemetery closes a certain time. What would you say about how police and the prosecution handled this case? Girl, they was off the chain. They were too good. They did their job. They, if I had some money to pay them, I'd pay them myself. They did good. They did with the, the A team did what they were supposed to do. The Tony and Nino now. Well, let me ask you this. The, the, the detective that was on this case the first round, obviously, this could have been solved 12 years ago. Yeah, if we had the right people. You're right. It could have been. They didn't know the once they got they're getting it together. Uh, everything just started coming together. Your point now. Yes. Your point now. Uh, my people. They ain't here somewhere. Gotcha. My police, you know, I got a handful of police on my home. What would you say to that first set of detectives that was on this case? I told Tony Armstrong what to tell him. You know, they bucks. Because they were doing a Holly Bobo time. I told him, look, I told, told Tony Armstrong, look, they got Holly Bobo killed. Why you ain't got the men on the streets trying to find Lorenzo's? 
Y'all know I didn't shut my mouth. That was my first book. I wasn't going. They still ain't made no sense about nothing to me. My idea for somebody else, but not to me. You said you go to the graveyard and you can hear Lorenzen telling you they don't give up. They haven't got him yet. They haven't got him. What were you telling me? Don't stop. No, he said, don't stop. Cause this one day I was thinking about, Lord, I'm just going to wait and see what happened. I was standing in his grave, girl. The aunt told my feet up. The aunt told me up. There was him telling me, uh-uh, you're not going to stop nothing. I'm talking about feet. I was swollen when I got home. It was him. That was him. That's why I wanted to walk in his last step. If they didn't understand why I want, it ain't like I just wanted to go see the bones. I want to walk in his last step. Maybe he would have left some for me. That's the only reason I want him to go down there where his body right. was. What do you think he was saying now? Oh, mama, you did it. I hear mommy, you did it. I want to give up this by first. He would just say that for me. But it would be some potential down the road with him. Because if he had heard somebody did something to me, oh, he got to help me. What is that birthday celebration going to be at? Oh, it, it's one of my friends got back from Hall. He got two of them, but he told me I got to go pick one of them out. But it's in South Haven? Right here. Right. It's in White Haven. It's really hard. Did you hesitate at all that you would find justice for No, because. What would make it sense? Well, nothing makes sense for them to say now again. After the, the, he called Billy Lawyers when them our lawyers came with a rebuttal, he crushed everything that lawyer just said. He crushed it. So when I did like, what did it feel like to hear the word? Oh, girl, you just like that, that, that detective said, Billy Hall, that's what happened. Pow, pow. Yes. And there they have it right there. In the Billy Ray Turner wow. case, guilty count one, guilty count two, guilty count three. Billy Ray Turner sitting there as we continue to watch uh, these live pictures coming from uh, 201 Poplar, showing very little signs of emotion. We also saw at the same time Deborah Marion, the mother of Lorenzo Wright. She sat there nodding her head as she heard the verdict read. Now... I missed that during the court session, y'all. Damn, Lorenzo. When dude was accused of killing his girlfriend, Jimmy, Lorenzo hired that lawyer for him. The one that was Billy Ray Turner's attorney. He hired that dude for Jimmy because Jimmy was accused of killing his girlfriend. And now the guy comes back and kills the same dude that ha God. you see what I'm saying about evil? Just evil. Oh my God. Well, there you have it. I wanted to hear Deborah Marion because I love that sister. And I'm glad that this sister held on, held on, because see, when somebody murder your family member. Oh, and her son? Oh, I, I, oh. I can't wrap my arms around somebody killing my child. It's bad enough when they kill a sister or a brother or my, oh, my child. Oh. I'm glad Deborah has got some vindication um, to that verdict because she deserved to see justice for her son. And uh, God, God bless that family. All right, y'all. I wanted y'all to hear the mom. So leave your comments below, please. And let me know what y'all think about the verdict. And Lorenzen's murderous, murderous ex-wife that would do that to him for a freaking million dollar life insurance policy that she spent in 10 freaking months. Damn. Okay. I'll see y'all in the next video. If you like what you hear, please subscribe and share.